Hello guys, this is Paula, here to do a flip through of the Pink Santa um, Christmas journal. Uh, this is a 6 by 9 journal with two signatures, and I'm going to flip through it. It's a chunky monkey. We decorated the front. It's done in pinks and golds, and kind of a different little bit of a red, and I did throw a little bit of black inside. I've got to go through it pretty quick so my battery doesn't run out. I'm sorry. Um, this is the inside cover and the back cover is the same. I love this paper. Um, and then I, I stitched a uh, pink, kind of a powder blue, a uh, powder pink kind of um, ribbon or lace on it. It's a little book journaling book. We made a lot of this stuff on some of our create videos. Vellum. I'm going to go through this pretty quick. Santa pocket with the black pocket with some embossing. There's some vintage pages in here. Pockets and tags. Tea stain paper. Ledger. Old vintage card, which did have some blue in it, but I just wanted to put it in here. I thought it would go nicely. Nutcracker in a side tuck. I stitched in all the lace. I here's fold out uh, tea stain paper, pink paper, more of the paper for the kit. And I did describe the paper in detail on a previous video. So if you want to hear about the papers, you can go over there. There's different colors of notebook paper that blend. There's some Southern Living Vintage um, pages in here. A couple different kinds of really beautiful ledgers. Graph paper. Just quite a bit of scrapbook paper because the paper collection is beautiful. Here is a side pocket. Let me push this up a little bit. Vintage music sheet. It's a very large sheet and it is very yellowed. Um, there's a ruffle on here and just lots of different goodies in here. There's like two tags and a couple journaling cards in this pocket. Center aisle. Center aisle center page uh, and here's some beads. Did the beads in uh, pinks and clear. Here is a, um, a pink envelope that I added lace for pockets and did all gold on the tags and there is three of those and they're all pockets with lace. Turned out really cute and more papers. I zigzagged pink on all of the tea stain papers. Another pocket of Santa and a couple tags. Um, another pocket with ornaments and a, some more tags. Here's some more of that iridescent vellum, which I love. Sheets of paper that you can really get in a lot of journaling for this December daily. And then here's some old printer paper that's been tea stained. Some great Christmas pictures from Southern Living Magazine, which is vintage. Some planning sheets. Here is an old, under the belly band, here is an old, I mean it's so old I had to make sure it was glued down because it would fall apart. Um, sled picture and I just added some different little fun embellishments and some lace and put it in the belly band for protection and it does say Merry Christmas uh, be happy yeah that's a cute one here is some altered tags there's two altered tags in the book this says peace on earth Ledger paper, tea stain paper, more of that Southern Living paper, tuck spot, journaling card, P 
pink val vellum, which I love, and the back of the first signature. This is the second signature with these beautiful ornaments. And this is an, an envelope that goes over, a long envelope that goes over the top of the page. And I decorated it. And on, on the inside, it just has a journaling book. Here's on the back side of it. It has a little bag with a little journaling card in it. Side tuck. Some more of the Southern Living. I want to say this has a hundred sheets used in front and back, um, which is a lot more than I normally would do. Okay, here is, we did a video on this. This is, this is that same book stitched in. Journaling card here on the side, tags inside the two pockets, or the two little bags, and the same on the other side. You'll see the other part soon. Here's another altered a clip and... There's the Nutcracker. He is the only real character in here. I love this. This is my favorite. This is um, uh, Trees. It says Have a jo Holly Jolly Christmas. Journaling card. And then it has all these various pastel trees. And I thought it would look nice in this book. And here's a ledger. A very long ledger that you can journal on. And you, I thought you could title if you wanted. And then on the back is another pocket. And then a lot of journaling space for anything you want to kind of hide from people. Um, want something personal. So white Christmas stocking. More tea stained paper. Some gray paper. That's the other part of those stockings. So pretty. Here's a flip for any private journaling. I zigzagged it twice across the top no once and then I straight stitched it and here's the fabric that the book is made out of but it's so pale it's hard to tell when you look at the book and then snowflake with the button grid paper striped paper vellum paper here's a, a little um, file folder that we have folded up and left a little pocket here with some music sheets and journaling card and it says winter wishes it's got this cute little swan with the christmas hat on side tuck with an ornament journaling card old vintage music sheet coffee stain paper pink paper this is a cool looking paper here this is the center more more beads here is a ruffle. It wouldn't be one of my books without some type of ruffle in the book. And moving on here, just different various papers, side tucks. Southern Living Magazine, some really cool Christmas pictures. Here is an envelope, and you know how I like to decorate envelopes, so the top is decorated with a fold-out. Uh, this is a side belly band, too. Here's the other half of, well, here's some more tags and cards. Here's the other half of that uh, big envelope that we did in a video. Here's a snowman envelope. He has a journaling card inside. I did some doodling on there. Vellum. And the last page. And last but not least, look at this paper here. I love this paper with all the Christmas bulbs. This is one of those that we did the other day on our video where half the button is glued down to hold it. Closed, you go out, you go down, and you go down even more and I, I doodled in gold around that so you can do whatever you'd like with that and then when you're done you just tuck it back under the button and you're done the back of the book the side of the book has lace and it will have a pretty pink bow tie for the closure all right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. 
to leave a comment about how you thought the pink journal turned out. And welcome to all my new subbies. If you haven't subscribed, please do. And um, I am going to be taking a break. And I should be back November. Let me look at my calendar. I should be back home by November 16th or 17th. So um, I might be able to do one more video before I leave. Uh, so watch some of my old videos and don't forget about me while I'm gone because I'm pretty new and I need you to come back. Um, so click that star, uh, the bell button and it will send, send you notifications. All right, guys, have a good Sunday afternoon. Bye.